Like many of you, I decided to build my first PC during the pandemic, browsed through countless photos on battle stations, did all the research on Reddit, watched all the videos on YouTube. I finally decided to build a PC around a graphics card, the RTX 3080. Picked out a motherboard, a CPU, power supply, all the bells and whistles. I even had to decide whether or not to go full on RGB on this thing, which I did. Downloaded all the necessary games like Call of Duty, Fortnite, even Among Us. As I started playing, I noticed that my USB devices would disconnect and reconnect randomly. Then it actually got to the point where it would do it so often, it would do it at least two, three times in a minute, which basically rendered my PC useless. So I knew I needed to figure out what was wrong with it. All right, the first thing you wanna do is you wanna disconnect, physically disconnect all your USB devices and then plug them back in. Uh, sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. Okay, if that doesn't work, the next step is to update your drivers. And to do that, you wanna get into this screen right here, which is the device manager. Um, hit the Windows key on your keyboard, type in device manager, and then you get this window. Scroll down until you see universal serial bus controllers. Okay, and you wanna go through these right click and update driver. So you want to do this with every single one. Possibly even restart your computer and see if the problem still exists. Third step, if that doesn't work, you want to go into device manager and you want to delete under universal serial bus controller, you want to delete USB root hub. Go into here. I'm not gonna do it on mine because I, I already did that. Um, you want to just hit the delete button, looks like. And then hit uninstall. Then when you restart your computer, it'll automatically reinstall itself. So in most cases, going through these steps should resolve your issue. But in my situation, it was a little bit different. I purchased the, apparently with the combination between the Ryzen 7 and the ROG Strix B550E motherboard, the combination of those two actually creates a conflict internally and creates that USB issue. So apparently the fix for this is you need to go into BIOS and reconfigure the PCIe uh, from auto to gen three. And I'm gonna do that right now and show you guys how to do that. Okay, so after you restart your computer and you go into BIOS, usually you can hit the uh, delete key and you can get into BIOS. So to get into the PCIe settings, you wanna go into advanced onboard device configuration. And here you'll see the list of PCIe modes that you need to switch from auto to gen three. Okay, Let's switch this. And that should be it. Okay, from here you can reboot and that should fix your problem. Going through these steps helped me with my issue um, hopefully it helped you with yours. If it did, let me know in the comments. And if you guys found value in this video, do me a favor, hit the like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video.